In daily repair experience, sometimes we need to troubleshoot with the phone board diagram. Today, we are going to share the GNSS diagram and the working flow of iPhone 12 series, and share more diagrams in next videos. First, let's start from iPhone 12 Pro Max. GNSS received the signal. Input from upper antenna interface pin 5 goes through resistance R3103 and go into coupler pin 28. Then output from coupler pin 29 goes through resistance R3106 and go into frequency bound splitter pin 4. Then output from splitter pin 1 goes through resistance R3105 and go into low noise amplifier pin 7. And finally out from amplifier pin 3 goes through resistance R3201 and go into radio frequency processor pin C14. Next, it's low antenna signal working flow. GNSS received the signal. Input from low antenna interface pin 10 goes through resistance R3503 and go into frequency bound splitter pin 4. Then output from splitter pin 7 goes through resistance R3501 and go into low noise amplifier pin 7. And finally out from amplifier pin 3 goes through resistance R3301 and go into radio frequency processor pin D17. Generally speaking, when GNSS signal have a problem, we can solve it according to above procedure and replace components correspondingly. Because iPhone 12 Pro, 12, 12 mini have similar workflow with 12 Pro Max, so we don't explain them one by one. Please enjoy following diagrams.